Hello world, it's Curtis Potter with your Balance Inspiration. Um, just gonna warn you now, she's probably gonna start barking if I don't keep her on this fix. Um, but today, I wanted to talk to you about being present. See, I don't have it all together. I haven't figured it all out. I'm not perfect, I'm not boundless. But I'll tell you, by all the mistakes I've made in my life, it's helping me and I'm, I'm learning as I go. See, I realized that for a lot of my life, um, well, I guess in this chapter of, of doing motivational speaking, I, I focused a lot on my past. You know, those lessons we learn and what went wrong so I could focus on the future of, of what I need to do right. But see, what I realized that, that sometimes when we focus so much on the past and what we did wrong, it's easy to get blinded by today and, and just being present and enjoying the moments. And, you know, it was something that, that I didn't even realize I was doing. I was focusing so much on growth and, and becoming the best version of myself that I wasn't truly just enjoying the today. Um, being an entrepreneur and a business owner, it just, you know, it opens the door for a lot of stress and worrying and and I've gotta do this, this, and this, do quotes and work and and run a crew and, and hire and, and just so many things. You know that naturally come because obviously you want to be prepared and and you want to have a game plan and and goals but i also realized it was robbing me of today and see the thing is 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 tomorrow is is actually it's it's not even real because you could die today so yesterday man it was an amazing day i've i've been practicing and being intentional on being present so yesterday I took off work um, because my workload had been so much and I realized I was I was robbing the time of being a present father at times to my children and my wife. So I just took off yesterday. Um, I set up the new job that I'm doing for Wednesday so so I could just go to the lake. And I, I'll tell you, it was one of the first times where I just put my phone under the, the seat of the truck and I didn't worry about just snapping all these photos. I knew my wife was going to take care of that for us. And I just spent the day enjoying the lake, the water, the the, the beautiful scenery, the, the conversations with my son and, and, well, my daughter too, but she was more like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> she... She still can uh, put together sentences or anything and only says a couple words you'll understand. But even that, I was enjoying those silly moments where my sister was punting, blah, 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 knowing that she was talking about the boat that was driving or floating by, the, or the bird that was flying by, or, or the snake that actually came within a foot of us and she was screaming at me, Dad, did you see that snake? And you see the smile on my face because I just took the time to, like they say just smell the roses so my question to you is are you so focused on the past or what other people have to say and judgment are you are the judgment that they place on you or the the judgment that you're putting on yourself are you struggling it with how hard your job is or how big of a dick your boss is or or something like that just to to show up be present give your 100 percent today if you look at your life and, and see that there's multiple places where you're not just enjoying the crap out of today, I invite you to do that today. See where you can enjoy today, no matter what it is. Because they say at any given point in your life, no matter how low you are, even if you're living on the streets, there's at least a million people in this world that would switch you lives like that. Even if you're homeless living on the streets eating out of trash cans here in the United States, there might be somebody over in, in Haiti or, or a third world country where they're living on the streets 
and they don't even have a trash can to eat out of. Living in 120 degree weather where they're sweating and, and you could see their ribs. Like even the homeless people here in the United States, I don't see any of them where you see their bones because they're starving so badly. Or somebody that's say in a, in a sex trafficking ring where every single day that's what happens to them. So I invite you today, embrace the crap out of your life. Enjoy every single moment that you have because tomorrow is not promised and see where you could be present to just elevate your life and the lives around you. If this helped you, please like, share, comment, give me some feedback, tag somebody, send in their DM text message. You know the drill. Let's get this message out here because this world could definitely use more people to be present in their lives in the lives around you i love you all you know the drill every day we're getting a step closer to being boundless have a great day